Welcome to the channel. I'm Tony the Technician. Today we're going to be going into the Home Depot website and checking out some of the tool deals that they have going on. We're going to be going over some good deals and then some not so good deals. Let me know your guys' thoughts if you guys have any experience with some of these. I really hope you guys enjoy. If you guys do, please make sure to smash that thumbs up. Leave a comment down below of your guys' thoughts on some of these products or if you have any experience with them. And as always, if you haven't subscribed, make sure to subscribe. Let's get into this. So here you're going to see a few Milwaukee products. So we'll be looking at some power tools as well as some hand tools. The first three items up here are the Milwaukee lineup. This set over here, $400. You get the drill, the impact driver, two batteries, a charger, and a case. And then with this, you get an additional free battery. With this battery purchase of the 5 amp hour, you do get a main item. So this battery is free. So here it'll just show you kind of everything that is available that you can select. So just keep in mind that the battery is the free item. So this 159 doesn't necessarily apply. It depends on what you select, I believe. And then over here we have the M18 half inch impact. And this is the tool only for 299, but that is also is going to include the free battery. And the free battery that's going to be included is the five amp hour battery like we saw. Then this DeWalt 15 amp 10 inch table saw is $550 down from a, a normal price of $650, which isn't terrible. I believe this goes on an even better sale near the holidays. So if this is something you're really interested in, uh, and you can wait. I do believe the deals get a little bit better on this. Some Ryobi stuff. Honestly, I don't have any experience with the the Ryobi lineup, but you have their oscillating multi-tool, jigsaw, and a couple batteries. The batteries are the 2 amp hour and the 4 amp hour with the charger, and that they say that it's normally $204 and it's down to $80. Once again, the Milwaukee stuff, this is just another item that's going to come with that 5 amp hour battery. A few more Milwaukee items. These first three are just discounted prices. And then this one over here is actually, I, I think this is a really good deal. $229. This is normally $370. It's, I have both this drill and the impact driver and then the newer version of this ratchet. I want to say the best deal I've seen for this uh, Gen 1 ratchet is like $75. It normally sells between $90 and $100 though. Uh, so for this being $230, I think that's well worth it. I think I, you know, I at least paid a hundred for the drill, a hundred for the impact driver and, uh, the new gen ratchet. I definitely paid over a hundred for that. Uh, so even though this is the gen one ratchet with this set, I still think it's a fantastic deal. You get, you get two batteries. You got the four amp hour and the two amp hour battery, the charger and bag. So I think this is a really good deal for $230 if you're in need of all three and it comes with batteries. I think that's a good all around little mechanic set basically. Here they have the eight amp hour high output battery for $200. It's not on sale, but this is one of those where you select an item and then you can get this $200 battery for free. They do have quite a few items to select from. I run the DeWalt 20 volt lineup and then I also run the Milwaukee M12 lineup and I absolutely love my Milwaukee cordless tools. Uh, I will say that their hand tools I'm very, very, very selective on just because I think they're overpriced. But when you can catch them on sale, a lot of their tools are really nice. And uh, when it comes to their power tools, if you can catch them on sale, if you're just getting into a power tool brand, uh, obviously Milwaukee's great. But if you can catch them on deals, it's fantastic. You can get some really good sets for some good prices. Here they have a rigid shop vac. This is a 16 gallon, six and a half horsepower wet and dry vac. And this does look to be like the one that has the removable top that can be turned into a blower. Yes. So there you can see it does have the detachable blower, which rigid makes some really good shop vacs. Uh, and I think $110, under $110 for this is a really good deal. It's normally $130, but if you're wanting a good quality shop vac, Ridge is def definitely one of them to check out. Here's the DeWalt batteries, two six amp hour batteries, $180. It was $240. And if you notice, they removed the XR from them. The XR is basically reserved, I think, for the power stack batteries now, and they've just removed them from the, the standard non power stack batteries. So earlier we were looking at this setup here with the impact driver drill, two batteries, charger bag, and the ratchet here, same price, but you're not getting the ratchet. 
So if you just click here, you have other tools you can select if the ratchet isn't what you're going for. So they have the soldering iron, the right angle drill, oscillating multi-tool, and the light. So not a whole lot of options, but some decent ones in case the ratchet isn't what you're going for. Here they have the Gen 1 at $150. It's definitely not worth that. Do not pick that up. Uh, maybe the new generation ones might be around that price, but definitely do not pick up the Gen 1 cordless ratchet for that price. Here they have the DeWalt 15 amp 12 inch double bevel sliding compound miter saw at $550 down from $650, so a savings of $100. Here you have a larger Milwaukee set of the M12 lineup. Uh, this is $220. I think that's good pricing down from $400. Comes with two batteries, five tools, a charger, and a bag. But keep in mind that these are not the, the top of the line M12 tools. These are kind of your, your uh, basic ones. But still, I think for $220, if you're just needing a good assortment of tools, I, I don't think that's a bad price at all. Here they actually have the new gen, one of the newer gen cordless ratchets. This is the 3 8 comes with the 5 amp hour battery, a couple of 5 amp hour batteries, and a charger for $200. So definitely don't buy the Gen 1 for $150. I don't know if the, I was missing something on that or what, but that's definitely not worth it. $50 more, you get the new generation and two 5 amp hour batteries and a charger. So definitely a better deal here. I don't think this one from DeWalt's too bad. $280 down from $330. You get the impact driver, hammer drill, two 4 amp hour batteries, charger and a bag at 280. I don't think that's bad. Once again, I don't have a whole lot of experience with Ryobi, so I can't really share my thoughts on you, but this one is at $160 down from $270. And then just getting into some of the hand tools, a lot of the Home Depot and Lowe's deals are going to be primarily on their cordless tools and stuff, but they do every once in a while have some decent deals on hand tools. Here they have the auto lock. This is the one that I had for $12 down from $18. Milwaukee does have their new USA made pliers and screwdrivers as well, which I think if you can find those at a good price, those are, are a really good deal. But at their full price, I don't believe it's quite worth it. Here's the flex head ratcheting wrenches, both metric and SAE at $450 down from $550. You will find better deals on these towards the holidays. So if you can get by without them, but you're interested in them, if you can wait, better deals will be coming on those. Here's the wide blade magnetic tape measure. Both of these are actually really good tape measures. The Fat Max and the wide blade magnetic, both at $24 and $25. Here are the other two Milwaukee sets. This is the ratcheting one, both metric and SAE. And here's just the combo wrenches, uh, metric and SAE, $400 and $220. Not horrible pricing, not great. Uh, and you will see better. So. Don't jump the gun. Don't spend more money unless you're set on the Milwaukee ones and you can't wait <laughs> for the better deals. Here is the Milwaukee half inch drive SAE and metric socket set. This is a 47 piece set for $260 down from $320. I don't think that's a great deal. Half inch drive, honestly, I don't use a whole lot of half inch drive chrome. I use a lot of quarter inch and three eighths chrome and a lot of half inch impact but it all depends on the work you do plus this is made for the pack out system so that's why it's a little bit more expensive milwaukee hand tools are already priced kind of high but you are getting good tools i have a couple of their ratchets and i absolutely love them they have fantastic ratchets and being a pack out set it becomes a, a little bit more expensive than just a standard set but once again this is having strive so i couldn't justify this but 260 dollars for this set a savings of just over 60 dollars here's one of the milwaukee screwdriver sets but this is not the usa made one for 23 dollars down from 30 dollars i want to say their usa made one is around 100 dollars. so here's the quarter inch three eighths and half inch drive sets so i believe just the one on the right is the half inch drive set and then the one on the left that is going to be both the quarter inch and the three eighths drive 540 dollars it's spendy down from 600 dollars and there are definitely better deals to come on them, but honestly, it's not gonna get much cheaper than that. These pack out socket sets are not cheap, even when on sale, but, and like I said earlier, a lot of their deals are primarily on their, their power tools and uh, hand tools don't get the best discounts. I will say I own three different designs of the Milwaukee locking pliers. I really like their locking pliers. 
I think they're good quality. I like their um, tightening mechanism that they have on the back where you can pass through or it's kind of a flat so you can grab it with a wrench, whatever need be. I, I like it over the knurled end that you find on a lot of the other just standard locking pliers. I think the Milwaukee ones are really good, especially when you can catch them on sale. This is a five piece set for $60 down from a standard price of $75. There's a Milwaukee hammer set for $150. I don't believe these are made in the USA. And uh, honestly, you can get USA made ball peen dead blows and dead blows for this price. You can get three or four of them for this price. So, and then here we have a quarter inch drive socket set from Milwaukee. It's a pretty decent size set. I want to say, I think it says 51 pieces, uh, $130 down from $140. There's a Ryobi screwdriver set with some precision screwdrivers for $16 down from $19. Milwaukee half inch drive 90 tooth 18 inch extended ratchet for $65 down from $75. Shoot, I think I paid almost $50 for their quarter inch locking flex head. I absolutely love that ratchet. I did not want to pay the price for it, but I really, really wanted it. And so I bought it. <laughs> so yeah, we all, you know, spend more than we want sometimes to have what we want. Here's the three piece set, quarter inch, three eighths, and half inch drive of the extended ratchets for $130. I don't think that's a bad deal, but that's all we're gonna go over today. So some good deals going on, especially with a lot of their power tools and then some not so good deals. And trust me, a lot of the deals will get a little bit better here in just a couple of months. So if you can wait, it's, it's worth the wait to get that little bit better deal most of the time so if you guys enjoyed today's video please make sure to smash that thumbs up leave a comment down below if you guys own any of these tools and your experiences with them and if you haven't subscribed make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys next time